this is Cindy and today I'm finally going to be sharing my updated skincare routine video and I don't even remember when was the last time I filmed my skincare routine that was back in when I was in London so like last winter or something so this video for me is the most highly requested video on my Instagram comments direct messages YouTube comments and I finally got around to filming this video and as you can see now I have no single bit of makeup on my face I just cleanse my face if you guys are wondering about my cleansing routine I would probably have that up before this video so if you guys are wondering what kind of cleansing products I use what kind of cleansing tips I have make sure to check that video before this so now that my face is nice and clean I would initially start with a toner and this is the Hanyu red rice essential skin softener this one I feel like I've started using since the beginning of this autumn and if you guys have seen my previous skincare routine video or my empties video you guys all know that I used to use this toner which is the pixie glow tonic this is very good at just you know toning your skin with a cotton pad but this one I don't really use it with a cotton bed I would just pour some on my hand and just push it on my skin because in that way it just gives a lot more hydration and rejuvenation to my skin so I just take this and get a good amount like that I would just kind of push it on my skin. My parents actually came to Korea as well um, as my sister and when we went traveling my mom shared this with me and after that night she was like Cindy I think it's the toner that you gave me but my skin feels so much softer and so much more plump. For me it kind of provides a really really well hydrated like baby skin feeling so I love this toner. And the next step I would do is move on to my moisturizer and this is the Belief Moisturizing Balm Moisturizer and this was kind of gifted to me by Jen, Jennifer Amu from Meech Muse. She said this cream was one of her favorite creams and as you can see I use lots of it so with my spatula I would scoop some out and just put it on my arms and rub it in this just feels so moisturizing obviously but it just absorbs into the skin really really nicely and very quickly too so I think this is a great night cream but for me I have a very very dry skin so I use this during the daytime as well so that's my cream but I also love the salt cream by Amber Pump Amber Farm and this was recommended to me by my subscriber on my Instagram I believe so I decided to give it a go and this is an amazing cream as well it's very very it's almost like sticky but it gives so much hydration and rejuvenation to the skin so I love this I actually ran out of this so I actually repurchased this so it's on the way to me if you have very very dry skin like me or if you have very sensitive skin too I think this is an amazing cream to go for as well so now that I have moisturize my skin I would move on to my oils you guys all know how much I love my oils I have this Kiehl's midnight recovery concentrate so this is the oil I would use at night I actually use almost half of it so that's a lot considering the fact that you don't really need a lot when you use it I only use like three to four drops when I apply it all over my face this I don't typically use during the daytime because for some reason because it says midnight I don't really want to use it during the daytime I feel like it would work a lot better if I use it during the night time so I actually discovered this from Dr. Jart is it and this is the ceramidin oil balm so this is like a balm but when you actually do kind of uh, rub it in it turns into a very light oil so I tend to use this during the daytime because I feel like it really absorbs into the skin very very nicely so it kind of doesn't move around the makeup since the Kiehl's one is a lot kind of heavier I tend to use it during the night time and like I said obviously with the name I feel like it would probably work better if I use it during the night time. Now is the night time I would use the Kiel one. So I would take some out and put three to four drops and just really push it into my skin. 
My skin isn't as dry after using the Hanyu Rai Skin Softener but um, I still have to give a lot of kind of oiliness to my skin before I go to bed so that I wake up next morning and my skin feels so much nicer and softer. So that was my skincare routine video. Compared to my last skincare routine I feel like it's a lot shorter but I think that's because I uploaded my cleansing routine separately. If you guys were wondering what kind of products I use, uh, what was updated in my routine, that was everything. It's not too much products for me I think so I hope you found this video helpful if you have similar skin types to mine and yeah I think I'm ready to go to bed now so I'll see you guys again in my next video bye